Hi, this is Liz LeBlonde, and this is my Core Principle 1 differentiation for my soldering game board project. Differentiation is when you create lessons based on your students' learning styles, you use your groups by shared interest, topic, or abilities, you assess the students' learning with a formative assessment, manage your classroom to make sure it's a safe and supportive environment, and continually assess and adjust your lesson concepts to meet your students' needs. My particular classrooms, I teach 9th through 12th grade all at the same time, and I also have students who are on a certificate track for a diploma, and then students who are on an A through G diploma track. So it's really important when I create a project that I think of the differentiation before I even start it to make sure I can meet all of my students' needs. For this particular project, the students worked in groups of three that they actually selected, and they naturally gravitated towards the students that they knew that were at their same level. When it came to the math or science concepts, the students were able to pick those concepts that they wanted to use in their game board for the theme, and they had the tendency to work with what they knew and were comfortable with. So my certificate students generally worked with lower level math problems, and my high-end students made very intricate games. I found that my lower students were much more engaged because they were working with concepts they were comfortable with and they knew they could produce a product that represented who they were. Students created a schematic, a components list, and instructions for each board. And for resources, we went over a lot before the game board started, but I made sure that students had all of this information available to them during the project for a refresher. So a components list, schematics of how-to videos, how to solder a switch, how to pick resistors, and all of this was available throughout the whole project.